Hello painters! Today I'm going to be painting on a cabinet door. I've prepped the wood by painting it with uh, two coats of Earth Safe Finishes Chalk It Up paint in cheesecake, which is kind of a buff color, and I have um, paint mixed up ready to pour. I have a gray, a mahogany, a tint of the mahogany, and white. So I'm ready to load my cups. They already have um, silicone in them, so I'm going to layer some white, mahogany, oops, that's the wrong one. Well, now I have three to pour from, don't I? And the tint. Since I don't like tilting, this might not be a bad plan to do three of them instead of two. And we're going to do a quick flip. You can see the cells forming already. And we're going to let those sit just a moment to allow the paint to fall. And I'm going to use a push pin and release the suction in the bottom. Okay. So here we go. This one has more white in it than the others which is fine. And now we're going to tilt just a little bit, see what happens. I'd like to cover just the raised panel in the center, but I'm not fond of tilting. I feel like I do a lot of damage tilting. Those colors are pretty though. I can imagine this color scheme in uh, like a library, an office. I'm not sure about a kitchen. Maybe a kitchen. Oops. I did not want that to go up on the side like that. I'm going to get rid of that. I've used more paper towels since I've been painting, which is about a year, than I have the rest of my life combined, I think. Okay, now I'm going to torch. I'm using a creme brulee torch and it's going to break up the air bubbles and promote cell formation. Look at those cells pop up. Okay. Let's see if I can tease this along. It's not bad. It's all about experimentation, isn't it? And it's interesting, what works this time may not work the next time. You just never know. I'm going to put you on hold while I finish smoothing that out, and I'll be back in just a minute. Here it is a short time later. All the paint is smoothed out and the edges are cleaned. Note to self, next time let's tape those edges. But I'm loving the colors, it's so pretty. I can see that in a kitchen now with ooh some kind of dark knobs on it. Those are pretty. I'm going to see if I can zoom in so you can see the cells. I 
There we go. It's been about a week now. The paint is pretty well dry. It's going to take about two more weeks for the paint to cure before I can varnish it. But I'm so pleased with the cells and the color combinations. This is really pretty. EarthSafe Finishes Eco Pour Kit, Chalk It Up Chalk Paint, and No VOC Varnish are available through the website. There's a link in the comment section below, and I hope you'll join us for the next video. Please click the like button below and subscribe. If you'd like to see some more finished artwork, please check out my website. There's a link in the comment section below.